Definitely woodcocker here. Welcome to Woodcock Hunt, buddy. Oh, we're back in Michigan today going after woodcock and rough grouse. Would have liked to hit it about a week ago, but I still think that the flight's going on. So if the flight's going on with woodcock here, that means it's going to be an action-packed time in the woods. They fly in some thick and nasty cover, so it's tricky shooting. You hear and see a lot of them, but it's tough to get a clean shot. Sure, go. Oh. I'll go in if you want to stay on the side. You don't have bells with you, do you? Uh, yes, I do. Do you? You have two of them? Okay, we're gonna get to this road here and then probably circle back and grab them. Shooter, here! Woodcock! Damn it! Shooter, here! Got it? No! Thing took off at my foot. There it goes again, Dad! No fight. Shooter, here! Get it? No, I can't see in here. They're here, though. I don't think it went very far. There was another one, Dad! Shooter, here! Here! Definitely woodcocker here. You're not coming out. Welcome to woodcock hunting, buddy. Damn, if I'd have been right here. I think I got that one. I think I got that one, Dad. Not positive. There, yeah. Shooter here. There's another one. No, I definitely didn't get it. That was it. I'd stay out there, Dad. It's almost impossible to shoot in here. Oh, Tiny, what you got, girl? Tiny's on point, Grant. Right here. Yeah. Tiny's on point, Dad. This would be if I hit it where it was at. Except I think this is where that one took off. Good girl, Tiny. She found it. Good girl, Tiny. Good girl. Another one just took off right there to the left. All right. Grant. Yeah. Thick and nasty, and that's where you find these. One of the toughest birds to hit. It's actually the slowest game bird, but they don't fly in any specific direction. So, extremely tough. Woodcock in Michigan. That is a beautiful. That is a beautiful, beautiful bird, isn't it? There are a bunch in here. They're not flying very far either. There goes one down. One up. Oh, I think it kept going. Flights in. Well, this property's been in our family for a number of years now, and one of the things that we've done is select cuts, which has allowed cover like this to grow up, which is perfect for grouse and woodcock, but also deer and turkeys and everything. And we're doing our best to manage the property for the wildlife that's on it, which is why we're seeing such large numbers of woodcock and grouse in our area, which is extremely rare. It's basically one of the only spots that has the correct cover for them. I was on it, but it went through a bunch of crap. I just want the dogs to work real quick. She's right here. The joys of hunting woodcock is the cover that they live in, thick and nasty. So it's getting a clear shot is very tricky here. You ready, Dad? Yeah. Okay. 
How many went up? One of the tricky things about walking through this kind of regrowth aspen is trying to find a shooting lane. So it's bouncing, kind of working your way th through and finding these little pockets like this one's perfect. So you get here, let the dog work for a little bit because you can basically shoot all over then get back in the thick stuff and just work in pocket to pocket. Right, go up there. Go. Do it. Okay, we got a little snake incident over here. Good. This area used to have a really high density of rough grouse, and just with habitat loss, it's dramatically gone down ever since I can remember hunting to where we'd be in this area and you go out and you'd at least flush 10 birds a day. Now you can go out and you can flush two to three. And all that is is because their habitat has been basically cut in half, if not more. So areas like this to where you go through and you have a habitat plan on cutting trees and so forth and creating new things like this is key to rough grouse in this area of Michigan. Dad, woodcock. I saw where it went down. Tiny here. This may be a grouse where she initially started pointing. It was by one of those berry bushes. like she's staring at it. Tell me when you're ready, because I swear that she's staring at it right now. Get in tight on her real quick, Grant. You to where you can shoot, Dad? She's got this thing pinned. Stay on her, Grant, not me. You get it? No. Just a shot. Look at dying down. No idea if I hit either of them. That's a big one. Yeah. Dear. See, we knew it was there. <laughs> Yeah. Hit him up. Up, oh, Mark. Now, well, missed that one. That last one took off from right there. I think we just hit you, hit that edge, Dad, and let's walk this way. There may be a second one there. That last one, it flew this way, so I think we just carry it all the way down and see if it landed again. Oh, I got point, Dad. You swing over here real quick. Grant, I'd swing this way behind me so you can see in the open. Right here. She's right here. I'd get back here so you can shoot that way. So you got that that lane. I think she's got it right in front of her. And I'm going to stand right here. I hit it on the second one? Yeah. I saw him drop. Okay, just walk. walk that way and I'll direct. Girl. Come here, Tiny. Good girl. Nothing makes you quite as humble as hunting woodcock in the thick stuff on shooting. <laughs>